Hello, welcome everyone to a uh, tutorial on how to set up your A50s in every single troubleshooting issue you'll ever have. Like, um, oh, my base station's not syncing up with my Astro A50s, my Astro A50s is not popping up on my PS5. For some reason, I can't update the Astro A50s for some reason on my PC. Um, and everything like that. There are so many difficulties and problems with... Like, when you first get this, you're just blind. You just think, plug it in, it's going to be good. No, there's a whole bunch of process we need to do in order for it, this uh, to get going. And uh, so, let's get started. So, you've probably set this all up. You probably looked at this diagram. You did everything. You set it up. It's like, okay, why the hell on my PS5 is not popping up? It's because we need to update the software of the Astro A50s and the base station. So let's go get to that on the PC. And there's an intricate process in doing that too. Ne nothing's ever simple with Astros. Nothing's ever simple. All right, we're here. So we have the USB. So it's going to be this this one uh, hooked up to the back of your base station. Your headset is firmly connected to the base station. Make sure that the uh, the double prongs right here are to the double prong and is magnetically set into here to make sure it's connected and good. Now you're going to want to plug this into your PC like I do here. Take this out. Don't need it. All right. Now it's in. Okay. Great. So now that's in. You see a light on your Astro A50s, you know, confirming that it's in. Now we need to update the software. So let's go and do that real quick. So let's look up Astro Command Center. Sorry, I'm doing this one hand, but all good. So there's very intricate things with this as well. All right, let's go right here. All right, folks. All right, so this is the difficulties with this. Do not download the Microsoft Store version of this. It's gonna, you're gonna scroll down. It's gonna tell you to download it for the Microsoft Store. Do not download the one from the Microsoft Store. That one does not work. It's not gonna connect your Astros. And if it does, it didn't do it for me anyways, but I never do that anyway. So what you wanna get is the link from the website to download it from the website instead of going to the Microsoft Store. In order to do that, you need to go through certain things. So let's go to support and we're gonna go contact us real quick and we're gonna scroll down to technical assistance, which is right here. Now after technical assistance, we're gonna scroll down, scroll down, scroll down until we get to the, uh, where is it? I need technical assistance for my product. And then after that, you go to the Astro Gaming Support tab, right, uh, this the little link right here. Now you're at this page, and now you could download it. You could download the Astro Command Center for PC. Download this, open it, let it run. And uh, so I already have it, so let me let me uh, go and get this real quick. Astro Command Center. All right, now once it's downloaded, it's going to pop up like this. It says, please connect an Astro Gaming device or or switch to the connecting device to PC mode. So make sure, first of all, make sure this is on. That's number one. I wanna make sure this thing is on. Okay, it's on. And then secondly, you wanna put it on PC mode. So we're gonna go do that real quick. Add on PlayStation, cause you know, PS5. All right, all right, now that I have it. Now, for instance, I had this trouble too. If this does not pop up and it's still saying, hey, you still need to connect it, it's because you have the wrong USB cable, okay? So there's a, you know, you need the adapter, the PS5 adapter, and then you get it for, you get another USB cable from the Astro A50's box itself. So you have two USB-C cables. You need to use the one for the Astros, okay? If you do not, if it is not connected, you need to switch out the cables, okay? Because those two USBs are different. All right, so when you have the right one, it's plugged in your computer, uh, this lights up. It's all good to go. You'll now pop up to this and then you'll need it It's gonna be like right here to update the firmware you go right ahead and update the firmware and let's get on to the next step Because there's more to this <laughs> than meets the man um, You could you can mess around with this if you want, but I, I left it as default the, um, Depending on certain games you probably want more bass, less bass, all that good stuff uh, I might make a tutorial later for certain games, but the, the default settings are okay but let's get to the PlayStation 5 settings. Now we're back here again. All right, so let's re-put back this real quick. Put this USB cable, this USB cable is so hard to put in. Jesus. You have to put in the optical in section. Make sure to put it in right, it just has to fit real quick. All right, 
back in. Okay, cool. All right, and then put this to PlayStation mode because you just had it right there, PlayStation mode. All right, also, another tidbit, if this does not pop up on your screen, is because you need to unplug this and plug it back in or restart your PS5 for this to pop up right here. If it just says PS, you need to switch it to, uh, you need to pop it off, pop it back in, or restart your PlayStation. So, as it sees, uh, it's charging right here. It has PlayStation and it has a star, which is the preset one. All right, now, finally, right? <laughs> We're at the PlayStation. Now, now, just because you have it plugged in doesn't mean it's going to be automatically the best ever. Okay, first of all, um, the YouTube video on for the Astros, their main channel, that does not work. You will, you will sound like absolute garbage to your friends or too loud. You'll start echoing. So uh, this is the exact settings. Shout out to my boy Pookie. Remember, he he first told me this. I I thought you would just plug this uh, headset in, it'll automatically be perfect. Life is good. You go out, you sniff the grass, all that shit. No, it's not good because the the Astros they don't tell you what the best settings for the PlayStation Five is. Uh, so my boy Pookie, uh, shout out to Pookie. You know he's out here. Put in the comments to say thank you, Pookie. He taught me this. So put Astro A fifty as the input. Put the output to Astro A50s, and you want your HDMI device to AV amplifier. Okay, you don't want it on TV or anything, and then you want to switch your number of channels to 5.1 channel. And then next, make sure it's on voice chat, uh, voice chat audio. Make sure it's not on all, and then that's that's good right there. Make sure your 3D audio shit is off. Make sure on that, and there it goes. It, then you're good to go. Um, I think that's everything and make sure you're on linear PC. Do not go Dolby like the YouTube channel says Oh go to Dolby. It sounds like absolute shit um, and th those are the best settings for the Astros and um, So another thing about the Astros if you just have it they have these buttons right here All right, uh, it's kind of hard to see right here, but if you see the left here it says it says voice and then on the right it says game so if you're talking to someone right now, um, you want if you want to hear them more, put it to more voice. You tap this, and if you hold it, it goes all the way to voice. So you gotta get the the best, you know, best of both worlds. You know, you want to hear your game, but also hear your um, whoever you're talking to. And if you want just game, you just hold this button right here. Uh, maybe some of you didn't even know this. If you hold this button all the way down, it will go automatically to game. Now um, these buttons right here. So this top one is like the Dolby After Effects. Um, I never really screw around with it. Um, right here is the EQ settings. So you have three EQ settings that you preset on the PC version. Um, mine are all default, so it doesn't really matter which one I'm on. But if you want to, you know, have certain defaults for certain games, like Apex, you want to hear people uh, more quiet. You want to hear footsteps more louder. Or if you're playing like a, I don't know, a solo game, you want to hear the more of the bass, the more of the atmosphere, you have different presets for that and everything. And then this is the wheel to, you know, increase volume and all that good stuff. All right. And that's it, folks. That is it for the Astro A50s. If you have any questions, put them in the comments. I think I explained everything pretty well, the whole process. If you, if you follow my whole process 100%, you will um you will get you will have Astro A50s working for you. I hope this helped. Remember put Pookie thank you Pookie in the comments for he taught me the PS5 settings for this and they work magnificently. Um and uh the other parts I had to figure out myself for hours on end and I was like, you know what? All these YouTube videos are absolute shit. I should make one so everyone is not lost and everyone can just do this real quick and watch this one video. Thank you guys for watching. Peace.